Hi, I am Michael Ganyan. My name is Lori Horhor. I'm Christo Noyan. Parev yes Lorini Atelianem, yes Tanadzen, Los Angeles. I was born in the US. And I was born in the United States. Parev Imanunas Rita Mevaliane, yes Tanadzen, Los Angeles, Imej. Armenia, we're home again. I love coming to Armenia. The adventures, the beautiful sights of Yerevan, amazing food. I can't wait till we get to the capital. Why only Yerevan? There are so many places outside of Yerevan that I love. Hor Virap, the green mountains of Lori, Lake Sevan. You won't see such stunning landscapes anywhere else. I have many friends in Armenia, and even though we live on opposite sides of the ocean, we share the same interests and dreams. It's really amazing. Our favorite movies, singers, school subjects, and most importantly, the dream of having an Armenia with a greener and healthier environment. I came here to help strengthen Armenia's foundation and to help make it a better, a healthier place to live. In the United States, I've learned that my home was greener. Years ago, there were many forests and trees here. The environment was clean and the kids were healthier. The new times have brought new challenges for Armenia. And to make their kids warmer. Today, those kids are my age. We are friends. We grew up together in different parts of the world. I'm thrilled that we can be part of preserving this beauty. Just imagine, we'll plant trees, and when we return to the US, our trees will continue growing on Armenian soil. Today I'm planting a tree in Armenia. Today I'm planting a tree in Armenia. Today I'm planting a tree in Armenia. Yes, I saw Zardan Getsi Hayastan image. Կարծեն <laughs> մեր աշակերտները հոգիներում մեջ գծան ենք կդնգենք հոգևոր ծառը եւ անիկա հայեցի տասերակությունն է իսկ հոս դնգեցին այդ ֆիզիկական ծառը եւ դարձել գահավատանք որ այդ երկու քմեկ իրականության մեջ մեր անկախության ծառն են դնգած եւ գուզենք օրմտեսնել որ այդ ծառը գմեցնա գմեցնա եւ այնքան կջուղավորվի թե ըստբրկ եւ թե հայաստանը անոր շոկին տակ հանկիստ կապրի in america we learned in school that Armenia's nature is rich with endemic animals and plants. I want to see them with my own eyes to understand the differences between the plants in Armenia and the ones growing in America. I hope I'll be able to plant the trees that I have seen in textbooks. Apricot trees, pomegranate trees, All the secrets of Armenia's nature was revealed to us thanks to the ATP Center. They listened to every single one of our questions and answered each one in detail. Կարծեմ կամուրջներ ծրագրի շրջանակներում երեխաները ամեն մի հանդիպում են կարծիքով վերածուն տոնի եւ ասեմ ինչի համար առաջինը որ իրենք ծանոթանում են եւ ծանոթանում են ինչպես ամեն մեկը ներկայացնում է իր ձգտումները զգացմունքները ցանկությունները երազանքները այնուհետև իրար հետ տնկում են սիմվոլիկ ծառեր իսկ ծառ տնկելը դա կրկնակի նրանց համար հետաքրքիր է Planting trees in Armenia means watering because it's like planting your roots here, and it's you're leaving a little something here from like a gift to Armenia from you, saying, okay, uh, well, Armenia, you give me so much. Here's something back to you. It's one step step closer to getting Armenia from what it used to be to even better than it is now. Thanks to the Building Bridges program, we learned important facts about Armenian nature while we were still in the U.S. Now, I know that environmental contamination and deforestation are major problems here. I also want to be part of cleaning and healing Armenia. Armenia 
area is very beautiful, so we want to keep it that way. We don't want it to get dirty or anything because it's the most beautiful place, country I've ever seen. It's better than it's really. <laughs> Sometimes you'll actually see people throwing like a plastic bag on the ground, and they don't even care. They're like, okay, just they just threw it on the ground. One of the reasons we're here is to help the environment here and try to make it as uh, beautiful and clean as possible. Together with our friends in Armenia, we learned how to plant trees, how to prepare the ground for seedlings, firmly bury the roots in the ground, and water the small, newly planted saplings. Asi inti hamar im hayrani kas kaliyev hogin tepnaliyev adang paner neder. Zarin hamar chemian im hayrani kis hedalal ne ais arite. Ya surakhi var nerang yegan Amerika is for irans mail hogin vrak ainen yev. We, just like the students who came before us, have already planted hundreds of trees all over Armenia, in Lori, Ashtarak, in various neighborhoods of Yerevan, It's a shame we're leaving in a few days, but our local Armenian friends promise to take care of our saplings until our next visit. I promise to find my trees every time I visit Armenia. Our friends were so skilled in planting trees and so attentive that next year I'm absolutely certain we will find strong trees standing here. The time seemed to fly but we learned so much in the course of a few days here. I now know what kind of indigenous plants, and more specifically, what kind of trees grow here in Armenia, how to plant and take care of them. The current 11% of forest cover in Armenia must be expanded to 21% to ensure that Armenia's lungs always remain healthy. Most importantly, we sowed seeds here, which we will nurture together with our friends. We will care for them throughout the years and it will be thanks to these trees that we will maintain strong bonds with our friends, our nature and homeland. This is like really special to like all of us right now because like you can't just travel to Boston to Armenia every day just to do this. And I'm really glad every like fifth grader, all the students get to come here. And We're planting trees right now and maybe there's maybe 12, 14 year, two trees is one life, so we're basically giving seven lives right now. Thank you, Armenia. It doesn't matter that we got our hands dirty, because it allowed us to feel the warmth of our soil. Most importantly, we sowed seeds here, which we will nurture together with our friends. We will care for them throughout the years and it will be thanks to these trees that we will maintain strong bonds with our friends, our nature and homeland. We need to say thank you to ATP for helping us find and strengthen our roots in Armenia. We will return back home and tell everyone that we have our very own trees in Armenia. I hope that the trees won't forget us until our next visit. And who knows, hopefully one day we too will plant our roots in the homeland just like the trees and stay here to build our country. <laughs>